Advanced Location Settings is a very dense page and will most often be used by our customer onboarding and customer support teams. We will use this time to show just how customizable Lavu can be for all restaurants. We won't cover every setting, but we will hit the highlights. Restaurants located in tourist towns where people from different countries often go can choose to display multiple currencies at the same time. Only two can be displayed at a time, but restaurant owners can set up as many exchange rates as they want. These exchange rates are not updated automatically and must be manually done from the control panel. The most recent exchange rate for a currency will be used. For restaurants that don't want to carry change or even just a particular coin, they can choose to use Labu's rounding settings or check totals. This will allow restaurant owners to round up or down to whatever denomination they choose. Day, start, and time is a setting that will be set by our onboarding team. This controls when reporting information rolls over to the next day. This is incredibly helpful for restaurants that are open past midnight and want orders started then to report on the same day as other orders taken that night. Tax included in all item prices does exactly what it says. This is a quick way to apply it to your entire menu all at once, rather than going category by category. Restrict order access by server will prevent a server who doesn't own the order from making changes or checking out the order. This setting does not apply to those with manager access. They will still be able to jump into any order and make changes. Most often, a manager will change the owner of the order so that a different server can close out the order. Bars may want this setting disabled so that multiple bartenders can add drinks to the same order. Allow order resend will allow an order to be resent to the kitchen. This is often disabled to prevent any confusion with the kitchen staff and also to prevent an order from being prepared twice. However, if a patron wants to make a change to their order, it is helpful for servers to be able to send updated tickets directly to the kitchen. Any resent orders will have a big resent message at the top of the ticket. Gratuity settings can be set so that a service fee is automatically applied to the order when a certain guest count is reached. Restaurant owners also have the ability to set what that gratuity will be based on a percentage. There are multiple settings for allowing access to crucial features like generic discounts and refunding and voiding checks and payments. Pickup labels can also be assigned to kitchen and receipt tickets. This is often seen in fast food restaurants where instead of collecting a name, a number will be assigned to an order. When that number is called, the patron will know their order is ready to be picked up at the counter. There are many other settings within this page that can help fine tune the POS to each specific restaurant. Our customer success teams are well versed in navigating this page and finding the settings that will work best for each individual restaurant owner.